Ferguson, I'm the director of Science Foundation Ireland, um, and it's my great pleasure to be able to introduce uh, Dr. Craig Ventner this evening. So Craig is widely regarded as one of the leading scientists of the 21st century, an entrepreneur and a really interesting person. He's best known for being the first, one of the first people to sequence the human genome and for creating the first cell with a synthetic genome. And he began the race to sequence the human genome when he unexpectedly announced to a room full of genomic researchers that they could just quit now, thank you, because his company would complete the task quicker, faster, cheaper than anyone else. People who like Craig say that he rarely filters his thoughts and usually shoots from the hip. So John Craig Ventner was born on the 14th of October, 1946, in Salt Lake City, the youngest son of an excommunicated Mormon who drank too much, smoked too much, and died at the age of 59. The family then moved to a working class suburb of San Francisco and lived in a house close to the train tracks. Ventner enjoyed playing checker. 2007, a team led by Sam Levy published the first complete six billion letter genome of an individual human, Ventner's own DNA sequence. So it is a very rare honor to be able to introduce a keynote speaker whose DNA you can analyze before the introduction. So if you launch the ensemble and you look at Craig Ventner's DNA, what do you find? Well, you find a genetic predisposition to wet earwax. You also find an increased risk of antisocial behavior, which I fear I may be on the receiving end at the end of this introduction. And you also find a genetic predisposition to Alzheimer's and cardiovascular diseases. Ventner's DNA is out there, and everyone can have a look at it, and I encourage you to do so. Craig has been the subject of great pleasure to introduce Dr. Craig Ventner, one of the world's leading scientists, an entrepreneur, and a really interesting person, to deliver the keynote address from reading to writing the genetic code. Craig. <laughs> Well, thank you for a uh, most novel introduction. Um, it was mostly correct. Um, I'll, I'll correct some of the errors along the way. Uh, my, my father was definitely not an alcoholic, but he was definitely excommunicated from the Mormon church. It was coffee and cigarettes, not alcohol and cigarettes, uh, a minor difference in some circles. Um, 